And now, from Fox 55 News, sports director Justin Prince with the area's most local sports. I still got three minutes to say it, so good evening, everyone. If the snow wasn't a uh, sign today that winter is fast approaching, then maybe this is. After two weeks of practice, the Indiana High School girls basketball season tipped off tonight here in the 260. We're going to get things started for you up in Turtletown. Bishop Dwenger opening their season on the road at Churubusco tonight. We're going to pick things up in the first. Saints with the lead, but Busco battling back. Brooklyn Sinclair connects on the corner three. She had eight. What'd you get for Halloween, Charlie Brown? I got a rock. Other end of the floor, uh, Anna Ponder gets a rock too, and she gets it in the bucket. Gets the layup to go, Saints go up one after one. And then I found Waldo tonight too, look at that. Second quarter, Busco keeping it close. Bridget Timbrook, she finds the bank. Eagles back up a pair, but then Dwinger started to separate. Giselle Ecke, right down here. That popcorn looked good. Going glass for two. And then you're gonna see Eki one more time. Good luck stopping this. Nine points tonight for the future St. Francis Red Flash. And then you're gonna see Josie Wharton. She pitched in with eight cans of three ball right here. Saints go up 12 at the half and they start their season with a dub. 44-29, your final on the road. All right, next stop comes at Leo High School. Lions hosting Lakeland for game number one. James Benson taking over the Lakers this year. Third quarter, Lions pushing on the break. They're up big. Isabel Collins gets the ball to up top and drops home the three ball. Leo goes up 37. A few minutes later, Lions still keeping their foot on the gas. This time it's Mackenzie Collins leads the break. She gets two of her six to drop. But the Lakers finally answer after that. Zoe Bowman comes hard off the screen, gets the floater to go, but uh, just too much Leo on their home court tonight. Isabel drops it down to Grace Bush. She had six as well. Leo opens the season with a commanding dub, 62-60. All right, final stop tonight comes in Woodland. First year head coach Dave Randall back on the bench out at Woodland, taking on the New Haven Bulldogs. Ada Kint King taking over at New Haven this year. Fourth quarter home team up big. Maison Wynn does it herself. Three ball off the rip is good, but it's still an 18 point game in favor of the home team. And then, uh, yeah, check out the passing here. That's Mariah Thulner to Alyssa Anderson. Easy layup is good. Other end, quick answer from the dogs, Elena Webb. Down the lane, easy bucket for Woodland and not letting him get much closer tonight. Brooke Kneibler passes to Thulner for the three ball. Randall picks up win number one as the Woodland head coach. Warriors roll 70-43.